The world is full of good news. The following are just a few. President Raul Castro welcomes His Majesty King Letsi III of Lesotho to Cuba, where the two leaders discuss enhancing bilateral relations with His Majesty expressing appreciation for the Cuban government's assistance and cooperation throughout the years. Visiting Libya, UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon affirms the United Nations support in helping the country transition to democracy through offered assistance in areas such as elections, a new constitution, public security and human rights. Australia and New Zealand partner to provide additional aid to the drought-affected residents of the island of Tuvalu as they send 450,000 liters of water to the country's main island along with two delivery trucks while supporting a mission to determine the needs of other islands. With Palestine's admission as a full member of the UN Educational, Scientific and Cultural Organization or UNESCO now confirmed, government officials state that they will seek membership in 16 other UN agencies including the World Health Organization. At a region World Health Organization meeting, the Philippine government is recognized for its efforts to curb smoking through initiatives such as raising taxes on tobacco, while the Metro Manila Development Authority is lauded for its public smoking bans in 17 cities and towns. Thanks to a 1 million US dollar donation from Japan, the International Organization for Migration is able to increase shelter and other emergency response operations in flood-affected Pakistan, providing some 24,000 people with tarpaulins, ropes, blankets, kitchen sets, solar lamps and sleeping mats. The Bristol, Tennessee Fire Department in the USA purchases special devices so that it is now equipped to help resuscitate animal companions who have become overcome with smoke, with each unit including a mask and hand-operated air pump. Saudi King Abdullah bin Abdulaziz Al Saud asks that 477 Palestinians recently released from Israel be welcomed to the country for the Holy Islam pilgrimage of the Hajj, saying that he is personally donating funds to cover their travel and related expenses. Thank you.